Philippine news today. Please subscribe and then check notification box to get all breaking news alert. The Queen is pissed. They were just arrested. Since the moment Prince Harry announced his engagement to divorced American actress, Meghan Markle, there's been nothing but controversy that's come from the couple, mostly has Markle past emerges in pieces. If she thought her secrets would be safe and she'd skate into the royal family with flying colors, getting by on her beaming smile, she was sorely mistaken. Markle's fiancé is in line to the throne and the Queen isn't letting anyone or anything into her family without undergoing extensive scrutiny. This has led to the revelation if what Markle's been hiding and now in arrest. The picture of perfection and elegance that this couple has portrayed over the last few weeks as they flaunt their love for each other from the States to the Royal Palace, has now been shattered as it seems like it was a front for something else. The American actress does what she is apparently pretty good at and that's pretending to be someone she isn't. When it was revealed who the soon-to-be princess father was, many people were taken aback by his recluse lifestyle at his home in Mexico, far from London. It seemed impossible that this man would be rubbing shoulders with the royal family and that he would be able to maintain any level of proper etiquette expected around the Queen or at a royal affair such as a wedding. The fact that Harry went rogue and picked a person without a pedigree was strange but celebrated since he was doing things his own way. However, it's not her father or even her stepsister who is in the crosshairs of the Queen, it's her equally obscure stepbrother and his fiancé who were just caught. It's hard to believe that Markle shares a parent with her half-brother since they look like complete opposites and seemingly act as such too. But what else is Markle hiding that's bound to come out before her royal wedding in May? The Daily Mail reports. Meghan Markle's half-brother Tom has blamed his drunken New Year's Eve brawl with his fiancé on the pressure and scrutiny caused by his sister's engagement. The flare-up in their Oregon home led to Tom's fiancé Darlene Blunt being thrown into jail for two nights for assault. Tom has blamed the pressure of being in the public eye for his woes, saying, it hasn't been easy. Meghan's relationship with Prince Harry has shown a spotlight on our family. It doesn't help when you have issues and your sister is engaged to royalty. It has a whole new level of scrutiny. And Tom, who was last year arrested for brandishing a gun at his fiancée during another drunken fracas, says they will both attend alcohol and relationship counseling. We've been under a lot of stress because of all the attention. At some point you find yourself drinking too much to escape the pressure. Tom vowed last night to seek help after the drunken confrontation. The prince has his PR work cut out for him on behalf of his wife and the misfit family she's bringing into the perfect picture. He's already slammed his soon-to-be father-in-law and Markle's family and claiming that she never had a family. While they may not be perfect and far from royalty, they were very close, according to Markle's half-sister Samantha Markle. Samantha countered the prince's claim with the facts of her and Meghan's upbringing that was different than the soon-to-be princess is saying now. It seems like Meghan is making her family life sound different than it was presumably out of embarrassment for her rather average American upbringing and also to separate herself from the drama. Considering how things went down in Oregon leading to the drunken arrest, Meghan has some face to save if she wanted to impress the Queen. Mail Online explains what happened that debaucherous and embarrassing evening. Tom initially told the Mail on Sunday Miss Blunt had begun pummeling me in the face with her fists, but last night he changed his tune and said the injuries he sustained were self-inflicted. As Prince Harry and Ms. Markle reportedly ushered in the New Year partying like tycoons in the Millionaire's Playground of Monaco, Tom and Darlene were downing beers and whiskey at the decidedly less salubrious Cedarwood Saloon in their hometown of Grants Pass. Tom, 51, who has the same father as Meghan, said he and Darlene, 37, rode at the bar before she stormed off. He returned.